every day, six days a week, usually around 5.30 in the morning we're here. We spar, we do mitt work, we do conditioning. If we were training for a fight, sometimes we'll go to UCLA and we'll train the way Manny Pacquiao trains. When I'm out of town, if I'm shooting a movie or just on vacation and I can't get to the gym, I have a whole routine I could do with just myself in a hotel room. Shadow boxing, jumping rope, sit-ups, push-ups, all that fun stuff, air squats. They train and they say this is the most important piece of equipment in here because, because it's unpredictable, right? When you hit that bag, it goes forward and it comes back. 100% of the time, you're going to connect. In a fight, a fighter probably connects 30 40% of the time, if they're really good. So, so this emulates the motion of another human being, and it's unpredictable. So, it's done with this ball. Now, it may look easy, but with my butt above my shoulders, and just slightly extending my arms, everything from my hips all the way to the bottom of my chest is being stretched and tested. So, instead of conventional sit-ups, I do a bunch of stuff here with my legs elevated, or I'll do them on the ground and move out like this. It puts an incredible strain on the floor. So as far as diet's concerned, since I work on a TV show that it's about guys who diet, I do something called the paleo diet. Nothing post-agriculture revolution, so no grains, no oats, no rices. Basically, uh, meats and anything that we would have eaten when we were cavemen, 